Welcome to our channel. Ronaldo scores late winner as a substitute for Portugal as 10-man Spain overpower Switzerland. Ronaldo failed to score at all in five games at the recent European Championship, but Portugal coach Robert Martinez has kept faith with the country's greatest ever player. Fabian Ruiz scored twice for Spain in their 4-1 win at Switzerland with the recently crowned European champions emerging victorious despite playing the majority of the game with only 10 men. Make that a record extending 132 international goals for the five-time World Player of the Year after Ronaldo came on as a halftime substitute and slotted home an 88th-minute winner for Portugal in their 2-1 victory over Scotland in the Nations League on Sunday. Minutes earlier, Ronaldo had struck both posts within a matter of seconds. Indeed, he was an ever-present danger in Lisbon, demonstrating he is far from finished as a force in international soccer, especially against the likes of a struggling Scotland. Ronaldo failed to score at all in five games at the recent European Championship, but Portugal coach Robert Martinez has kept faith with the country's greatest ever player and is reaping the rewards. On Thursday, Ronaldo scored his 900th career goal, spanning games for club and country, in a 2-1 win over Croatia. The quest for 1,000 began three days later, and he didn't disappoint, despite only playing one half. In stoppage time, a spectator got on the field and attempted to get a selfie with Ronaldo, but was stopped by security. That happened repeatedly at Euro 2024. Scotland went ahead through Scott McTominay in the seventh minute before an equalizer from the edge of the area by Bruno Fernandes in the 54th. Luka Modric turns 39 on Monday, but, like Ronaldo, remains as integral as ever for his country. The Real Madrid midfielder again demonstrated his enduring quality by clipping home an exquisite free kick from the edge of the box in Croatia's 1-0 win over Poland. It was Modric's 27th goal in 180 appearances for his country, which left him tied with former Spain defender Sergio Ramos as the second-highest-capped European players in men's international soccer, only behind Ronaldo with 214. Robert Lewandowski, another veteran at age 36, hit the goal frame for Poland, who beat Scotland 3-2 in the first round of Nations League group games on Thursday. Fabian Ruiz scored twice for Spain in their 4-1 win at Switzerland, with the recently crowned European champions emerging victorious despite playing the majority of the game with only 10 men. Centre-back Robin Lenormand was shown a straight red card in the 20th minute for bringing down Briel Mbolo as the last man, by which time Spain was leading 2-0 thanks to Jose Lu's header from Lamine Yamel's cross in the 4th minute and Ruiz's goal in the 13th after Nico Williams' shot was saved. Ziki Mdowney pulled a goal back for the Swiss before halftime, but substitute Ferran Torres set up Ruiz for his second goal then scored himself to clinch Spain's first win of its Nations League title defense. The team drew 0-0 at Serbia on Thursday. Swedish soccer fans paid tribute to one of the country's most famous coaches and then celebrated the further blossoming of the team's new strike force. There was a minute silence before Sweden's home match with Estonia in honor of Sven Goran Eriksson, who died on August 26 after battling cancer. An image of Ericsson was shown on the big screens in the Strawberry Arena just outside Stockholm. Sweden won 3-0 with Victor Jokers with two goals and Alexander Ezak scoring.